So my name is Chuck Friedman, Director of Developer Platform at Rivet. Uh, welcome to the very first Rivet Spawn. Excellent. I want to thank all the developers. You're all developers in the audience. No matter uh, what you're interested in Ribbit, today you're developers. I hope you brought your developer hats. I also want to thank the Ribbit team that's here, most of which are speaking. Uh, the others like Nara and Brendan and Peter uh, will be here as we go through the code solutions. If you have questions, they can actually come over, take a look if you're stuck, and help you. That way we can uh, continue to move forward. Um, we just had the Flex Crash Course uh, by Ted Patrick. Because if you understand how Flex works, you're going to be able to do dramatically more with it. It's a very straightforward way to uh, wire data together. So in this case, the data so, the line. Uh, We already had the Flex Crash Course. We're doing Rivet A to Z now. We have uh, some great food and networking coming up uh, during the lunchtime hour. And then from 1 to 2, we'll be doing our Rivet business opportunities. Most of us have the idea that we want to make a business somehow, or if we have a business, we want to create new value by integrating voice into that, into that business. And that's really what we're here for, the dollar sign. And how do we do that? Once you have an application that you can integrate voice into, you get not software, but you get voiceware, and that's what we're after. We're at Revit trying to bring together this whole computer telephony world with applications, and the applications are where people can derive value. What you can do is you can build an application using the API that will work with the amphibian server. So as we you grow a large amphibian subscriber base, then this will become an important way for you to monetize the application. Applications can be built either that work with amphibian, and those are the personal applications that Crick talked about, and there can be enterprise apps where you don't actually have a Rivet user, but you're using more of the infrastructure. You know, what we're seeing in, in folks that we're working with around different categories of applications, and these are all things that we haven't thought about these things before, but now that voice is available, we can build these applications. We don't want to build these applications. We want the community to build the applications. Uh, what we're going to do in the afternoon is we're going to break off into team coding, and also at that time, myself as well as the rest of the Rivet team will be coming around to help coach you. I was kind of looking for some company which really does this in, a, in an enterprise level. You know, you have click to call or Daxter and CQ, many things, you know. They don't have workflow and they don't have any kind of a enterprise infrastructure. The Rivet has gone beyond everything and showed such a beautiful and a, uh, you know, good infrastructure that way we can build applications. I think it's opening up a lot of possibilities for the web. Everybody has cell phones, <laughs> and having the ability to call cell phones and, and phone lines um, from your computer uh, just opens up so many different opportunities. I can't imagine all the stuff that's going to come out from it. See, one area where I feel this can help is completing those transactions. So people view the sites and they find the locations or choice of mm -hmm. restaurants or what have you. But having a, just a button right next to it to complete the call. So I've basically just changed this Yahoo local page uh, to, you know, to enable Rivet. It was good to meet some other people in this industry who are going to be contributors or competitors. A broad spectrum of people that you have here from different industries, different age ranges. So it was good. And, uh, starting at 5:30, we're going to be doing a cocktail hour, and we'll also have a screen set up there to do uh, presentations so you'll be actually able to show us all what you've coded or what you're interested in coding in. So we're very excited about that. And when I call the number, the map should change to my address, which is Simi Valley, California. So we'll search all the photos in Flickr uh, with the tag ribbit. I can click on a photo and then I can talk about that photo. All right, let's see if this plays. All right, that was it actually. <laughs> that was under a whole lot of oohs and ahs.
spent a good Sunday with Rivet. We certainly hope it was uh, well worth your while because we are hoping and planning to do this again at some point. The stuff that comes out of this meeting today is going to be uh, very exciting to see as it launches. Also, I'm Chuck at Rivet.com. You can contact me directly. And I enjoyed meeting uh, every, every one of you and working with you guys, and you did a fantastic job. So thanks very much, and uh, finish up the food and drinks, and uh, enjoy the rest of the day. Thank you very much.